What's up guys it's the real deal welcome back to the channel guys today i want to show you just a little trick it's going to be a short video this one for the mysterious gift and i think a lot of players are not aware of this usually we just tack, you know we just go down here we click open all first of all we don't want to do that the other thing is these event missions we want to be just you know saving our diamonds for this burning through these um recruitment cards as well so the crappy yellow cards that we get we want to save these as well and only pull during the mysterious gift uh, event so we can get an extra um i don't know what these are called wish coins <laughs> extra wish coins uh, then the other thing is whenever i um like awaken a champion now i hold off until this comes around and then I start blowing that nucleus dust. It's the blue one. So we'll just have a quick look in uh not evolution. In heroes. I think I've actually I've done everyone. And that's not someone that you can awaken. So if you come to Leo, go to potential, and then in here, I would have kept this, and then we blow our blue dust on this to get those extra points. Or well, extra points? No extra missions so we get extra wish coins so then this is the most important thing so we've got 14 let's do a couple and we're going to turn off do not remind me and you can actually click and choose which one you choose uh open and i just can't believe this like i did not know that for a very long time and again just need to get a little bit lucky there we go so that's going to help us skip ahead and collect more of these gold bars and there's a little bit of luck involved but it definitely feels like the smarter way to do it rather than just let the computer do it for you pick up some more stuff what's in the box oh there's some really good stuff in here i wouldn't take the sp champions um i'd probably go for the awakenings first and then once you've got the awakenings i mean it's a, gonna take you a long time to get through that yeah go for the awakenings for the champion that obviously you want to awaken if you did all that, I'd probably take the temper material. If you don't need temper material, then I'd go for the SP heroes. But three is not a lot. Not a lot at all. And again, straight off the bat, it's far left. So let's take another one. Ooh, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Oh, and we're out. But um, that's literally the tip is you just want to try and you want to pick yourself because if you just do open all, you are going to end up getting trash and you won't get as far through. And if we go to uh, reward details, so this is what rank five is giving us. And we want to try and work our way down to like round nine and spins as soon as possible. Um, sometimes... Obviously, there's a lot of luck involved and you can't always sort of get to the very bottom. But if you do get to the bottom, you know, we're going to be getting loads of way better rewards for our accounts. Um, obviously, the best hack would be to spend money on this. But as always, I always recommend trying to be as free to play as possible. Do not spend money on uh, gacha games, in my opinion. But that's pretty much the end of the video, guys. I hope these little tricks and tips help you with you know just trying to get through the mystery gifts and get better rewards for your account that helps you progress faster thank you guys for watching please leave me a cheeky thumbs up make sure you smash smash that subscribe and i'll see you all in a video soon peace